How's it going guys? Damien here from Clove and today we'll be running through some of the most frequently asked questions about the new stunning Mate 20 Pro. Now hasn't October been quite the month for smartphone enthusiasts? Before you even have a moment to catch your breath, Huawei dazzle us with the new Mate 20 Pro at their launch event in London in the middle of the month. Now if you weren't lucky enough to make it or to see it, here are some of the top tips and top questions that have been asked about the Mate 20 Pro. Now after the success of the P20 Pro, did you know that Huawei recently overtook Apple to become the world's second biggest self smartphone seller? Phenomenal feat of engineering there and just really shows how good Huawei are really being. And the hype has been undeniable. So we've endeavoured to answer some of the most pressing questions now that the device has been unveiled. So, question one. When was the Huawei Mate 20 released? Well, the Mate 20 Pro was officially unveiled at Huawei's launch event in London in the middle of October, whilst the Mate 20 Lite was released in the UK in September. Now, Americans, I'm sorry, you will not be getting the Mate 20. It's just not happening. You're not gonna be getting it there, but there is a way around it. You can buy it from us. We ship to America. So you can get your Mate 20 Pro in the States. Happy days. The Mate 20 Pro is now officially available in the UK, being released on the 26th of October. And if you were one of the fortunate people to have pre-ordered your device in the UK, then you will also be able to claim your free Huawei watch, which is the GT watch, and also your wireless charger with your order. And it is the fast charge wireless charger, more importantly. And from what I understand, it is the fastest wireless charger available on the market, which is a big thing. It's a very big thing. Now, question two. Where can I buy the Huawei Mate 20 Pro? Well, if you're watching this video, you should be buying it from us. Pretty much, there's your answer. But currently, you can buy the Mate 20 Pro from Clone Technology in either black or in twilight like this one, with the 128 gigabytes of internal memory, and the six gigabytes of RAM for an astonishing 899 pounds, including VAT. Now, we are expecting the emerald green variant to be arriving with us um, in November, but no fixed date as of yet. The same day worldwide shipping is available, and we can assure you that you will be one of the first customers to get your hands on these new devices. So keep an eye out for that. Question three. Does the Huawei Mate 20 Pro come in dual SIM? Well, simple answer, yes it does. The Huawei Mate 10 and the Mate 10 Pro both came in single and dual SIM options, as does the Mate 20 Lite. So it would be little surprise to know that the Mate 20 Pro, well, that comes in dual SIM as well. So currently, only the single SIM variant of the Mate 20 Pro is available with Clove. However, the dual SIM variant is available from next week and will be in the twilight color, just like this one. So do keep an eye out for that. Also, be very careful to have a look that when actually looking for the device itself online, make sure that you are clicking on the dual SIM variant, not the single SIM variant. It will be actually within the description, so do pay attention. Question four, does the Huawei Mate 20 have wireless charging? Yes, of course it does. This is one of the biggest things about it, hence why you also get the wireless charger. Now prior to this, the only Huawei device that supported wi wireless charging was the Mate RS Porsche design phone, which came out earlier this year, and cost nearly 1,400 pounds. This is nowhere near that. And not only does the Huawei Mate 20 Pro offer less wireless charging to itself, it charges other devices too with its reverse charging. So always bear that in mind. Mate 20 Pro is really standing out there. Now the, the actual wireless charger that comes with this is a 15 watt charger. It is the world's fastest world charger. Now that's Huawei's words, not ours, but still it is the quickest wireless charger. So do make sure that you have that and do make sure to check out the wireless reverse charging, which we do cover 
in our unboxing video, which you can actually click here to watch. What is the camera setup is question five. What is the camera setup of the Huawei Mate 20? Well, with the Mate 10, Huawei created a device with a very respectable camera setup. However, with the P20 Pro, Huawei became industry leaders. And if you've had a P20 Pro yourself, you will know how incredible the pictures are that that camera takes. As such, the Mate 20 Pro has followed in its footsteps of the P20 Pro and offers the triple lens camera as we found on the P20 Pro. However, they swapped the 20 megapixel monochrome sensor for a 20 megapixel ultra wide angle lens powered by the AI. The 40 megapixel, the 20 megapixel and the 8 megapixel lens along with the flash are arranged in a 2x2 two two formation in a square shape on the back. So many sensors we don't know what to do with them all but I tell you what, the Mate 20 Pro has taken some of the most incredible photos I have seen taken on a smartphone and it's going to make it hard for you to actually go, hmm, should I take out the digital camera or should I take out my smartphone? Well, when it comes to the zoom, that's where it's a bit different, but the Mate 20 Pro is just quality. I can't fault the camera whatsoever on this. And, you know, as you will see with that when you've got your own one. Now, question six. Does the Huawei Mate 20 have a headphone jack? question and the answer is uh, no. No, it does not. Instead, it has a USB-C adapter to the 3.5mm headphone jack, as we are seeing on a lot of phones nowadays. And it was actually something they decided to get rid of a little while ago. The Mate 10 range of last year did have some variants with a headphone jack. However, the Mate 10 Pro did not. And again, the Mate 20 Pro does not come with that either. So, no, there is no headphone jack, but you get the little adapter with it, so no worries there. And the final question I'm going to go through today, and if there are any more questions, by the way, that any of you want to go through, comment below, and I'll be sure to come back to you on them. I might even do a part two of this. I don't know. We'll see how things go. But the final question, is the Huawei Mate 20 Pro waterproof? If you're like me and you drop your phone in water, you want to know that it's covered. You want to know, I'm not going to lose my £899 phone that I've just got my hands on and drown it in the river. I can still jump in after it and get it out and we'll still be good. As many of the flagship devices before, both the Mate 20 Pro comes with the top of its class IP68 rating. An IP rating code refers to protection level against external objects. So the first number in this case is the 6, which describes the level of protection against dirt or solids, shall we say. The second number, the 8, refers to protection against moisture. This 8 awarded means the device is protected from immersion in water with depths of more than 1 meter. Whilst you wouldn't take your uh, Mate 20 Pro swimming down the local leisure centre, this is the highest rating that a smartphone can be awarded for protection. So, if you fell in with your phone trying to take a selfie, so be it. Not the end of the world. You're covered on this. But, as I said, that covers everything that we've been asked so far. The most asked questions about the Mate 20 Pro. If you do have any questions, as I said, please comment below. And as this before, Click on the link just here if you would like to find out more details on the Mate 20 Pro or if you would like to pre-order or order, shall I say now, your Mate 20 Pro. And remember to always subscribe and to like our videos. Thank you for watching guys and I'll catch you next time.